Hey everybody, Rookie I'm handicapping thoroughbred racing in my hometown track, Penn National Race Course, Grandville, Pennsylvania, on Thursday, February the 6th. This is my day at the track.com thoroughbred race of the day. Take a look at race 5 tonight, folks, 7 49 p.m. Eastern Post Time. Mild test on the dirt track. Four year olds and up race are optional claiming prize of some $30,400. Contenders number two, Handsome Harbor. Number four, Pledge of Truth. Number six, Van Percy. And number three, Outhaul. Number two, Handsome Harbor. The overall speed and pace profile leader in its optional claiming field tonight, racing at the mile distance on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, including back to back power run wins in his second and third races back. Jockey Armando Ayuso has been in its irons on five previous occasions, hitting the board in each when he twice back tonight here at Penn Nat for his sixth ride. Number four, Pledge of Truth, has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, winning three times in this recent streak of racing consistency. Race five summary, number two, Handsome Harbor, tops the contenders list tonight here at Penn Nat, which also includes number four, Pledge of Truth, number six, Van Percy, and number three, Outhaul, two, four, six, three in the fifth from Penn National. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race eight, number seven, Poppet's Pick, a 10 to one bomb, drops in class by three track master units. He's hit the board in power run fashion in three of his last four, including a power run win in his fourth race back. Gulfstream Park, here in the $75,000 Awesome Feather Stakes, Six to one shot. Number three, Munning Sister takes the four level Trackmaster class drop. It's won five of nine in her career to date, sprinting at her about today's distance of five and a half wrongs on the dirt, including back to back power run wins in her fourth and fifth races back. So from Penn National on a Thursday, Rick Needham for Day at the Track.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.